I'm just going to do a quick update for you guys because I've not really posted anything for a little while. Um, I've been pretty busy, as I'm sure you can guess, and as you can probably see from my Instagram. I've been doing some really cool projects. Um, and just in, in terms of sort of updates, I had a Pocket 4K on order, um, and it was a little over a month or so that I had it on order for. And then obviously a few days ago, the, the 6K got announced. So I decided to can well switch my pre-order from the 4K to the 6K. So I should have a Pocket 6K coming at some point soon, hopefully. Um, I was I was quoted, you know, within a couple of weeks. Um, but there seems to be a lot of them out there in the wild already. So I'm hoping it's a little bit sooner than that. So you can expect a video review of that to come. I've also got, um, I was going to do a video about sort of my ideal rigging setup for the Pocket 4K, but that's now going to be a Pocket 4K slash 6K video. Um, and that will be coming obviously once the camera comes. Um, I've been working, I will be working with Small Rig on that one. Um, I'm also talking to a couple of other companies at the moment about potentially doing some product reviews for them. So there will be more product reviews on the way. Uh, what am I doing this week? This week I've got a shoot in London, which is for the same client as a shoot I did last week, which was NDA to buggery, so I can't really talk about it. All I can say is it's an interview with a well-known director um, about things. Beyond that, I can't really say anything, which is a shame. Um, the one I did last week was actually at Leavesden, um, and it was my first time at Leavesden, which was a really cool experience. Um, what else am I doing this week? Today, I'm, I'm running a bunch of errands. I'm going to pick up a cheap sort of plastic box for all my 13 amp distro. I had a meeting yesterday um, with Becky and Jamie. Uh, Jamie's an editor I know, really good editor, um, and we've, we've sort of got the ball rolling with post-production on out of time. I think we've still got three or four scenes to shoot for that, so you know that's going to be a little while yet. But we're hopefully the edit will begin in September, um, and hopefully that will be out before the end of the year. That would be really good. Um, but I'm going to go and grab some lunch. I'm going to sort of get my errands done, um, and I might do more of this kind of style video, perhaps a little bit more vlog style, but just using my phone just for you know speed and convenience because uh, I don't always want to be running around with a GH5 or GH4 or whatever I'm using um, oh that reminds me finally 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 got my GH5 back from repair because the main uh, board on it just died inexplicably one day it just decided nope I'm not gonna turn on so I sent that to CVP like three months ago now um, and they were just waiting on Panasonic. I, I just want to shout out Tom at CVP. He's been fantastic, and he's basically like been pushing for ages to try and get this resolved. And there were a number of issues and a number of things that sort of happened that meant it kept getting held up, and, and things weren't happening as quickly as they should. So it's been almost three months. You know, big thank you to Panasonic for actually, you know, eventually sorting it out. And a massive thank you to Tom because he spent many, many hours trying to get this resolved for me. So, you know, I really, really appreciate that. Anyway, yeah, that's probably it for this update. Um, I may do more vlog style content um, just when I'm, I'm doing something interesting that I feel is probably worth vlogging. Um, or short update videos like this. Um, but yeah, keep an eye out for some more review content because that will be that will be coming very very soon. Here's my problem. I'm in B&M and I'm actually sport for choice. There's like many many options of boxes because um, I've got like two drums and then a bunch of multi plugs that I all just want to throw in one single box. But I don't want to get something too big because it's got to fit in my car amongst other kit. Because at the moment I just sort of fit them in gaps. 80 which is absolutely huge because the 30 is way too small so I feel like the 60 might be a good option. Do I try the 30? I mean I really should have brought the drums with me.
had a pretty good idea. What I've done is I've come to the electronic section of the store. I've grabbed a couple of their drums. They're slightly different to mine, a lot smaller. But what I've done is I've put two of them in the 30 litre. And then there's room for like another two. And that also leaves room for the 13 amp multi-plugs. So I'm thinking actually that the 30 litre might be enough. Um, I've just gone and picked up a box. Um, I'm hoping it's going to fit everything, but we'll see. I've also just had an email about my Pocket 6K, um, and they said they're expecting stock at some point in the next week or so. So it's it's going to be at least a week, I think, before I get my camera, which is a bit, you know, it's a bit shit. But it is what it is. It'll arrive when it arrives. I'm just looking forward to sort of testing it out and and sort of piecing together the things I need for the review. I, I want to do a bunch of SSD and SD cards, CFast. I want to test loads of different media with it like I have with the Mavo. I've just not done a video about the Mavo LF. So if, if you want a video where I'm testing different SSDs for the Mavo LF, I've put together a sheet with the data on from my tests and that's in the Kinevinity Facebook group. Um, but if you want a video about it, let me know and I'll make one. I've literally just got home from the shop but also the post office and in my mailbox there's a missed delivery notification from royal mail <sighs> meaning tomorrow i have to go to the same post office i've just been to to collect a parcel that i've missed because i had to go to the post office that's just <laughs> that's so dumb Actually, I think the postman's outside. I'm going to see if I can catch him before he goes. I missed him. <laughs> I saw him on my road, came in, saw the notification, went back out, and he was gone. Like, literally, completely gone. I don't know where he went. I don't know how he disappeared, but he was gone. Um, and also, also, I'd like to clarify, that delivery, it's not my Pocket 6K. It is, in fact, a T5 SSD for the Pocket 6K. Um, so... Eh, I'll go out and get it tomorrow. It's not a problem. It just would have been nice to not have to fit in going to the post office tomorrow when I've just been there today. Day. So I got the 30 litre. I've brought it home and it almost fits everything in apart from that drum. I've got the slightly smaller, I think, 25 metre drum in the bottom and then I've loaded up all of my 13 amp multi-plugs they need rewrapping a little bit because they're a bit messy. Um, but I've got all of them in there. So the only thing I have to carry separately is the bigger drum, which is fine. I'm cool with that. The lid actually does fit on as well. Um, so there we go, he says. There we go. It, it does fit. It's just not fitting now because why would it when I'm videoing to prove that the lid fits? But yeah, all good. Happy days. Um, so yeah, I'm going back to the post office tomorrow and deal with the picking up of the T5. I'm just waiting to get the Pocket 6K and start doing stuff with that camera. Um, but for the rest of the day, I think I'm probably going to colour grade some stuff, update my website a little bit and just send some emails. Um, and then I've got a conference call, as I mentioned earlier, later today. If anything more interesting happens, I'll add it to the vlog. But if not, I'll catch you in the next one, guys. Thank you.